There's something... There's something I've got to tell you. I'm obsessed with shower gels. Get up! That's going to be rubber dubbing in the bloody tub! I'm going to be rubber dubbing inside this tub because I love shower gel! There's something i got to tell you. I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed with shower gels! I go crazy every week, I buy as many as I can get, I get as many as I want. This one is so fucking good. The oils, the mango, I am in love with all the fruits and the smells and just the shower and the bar. <laughs> Oh my god, that looks lovely. I'm gonna get in that tub! I'm gonna rub it up in that tub! No. Nah. Do you ever have a secret obsession? Something that's taking over your life! Something that you can't stop! Something that you wanna stop but you can't! Something that will never stop because you want it more and more! That for me is shower gels. Well, and everything else. But shower gels mainly. Shower gels is something I buy every week. Hello everyone! So let me get straight into this video, let me try and be as quick as possible, I'm not going to be too quick but I'm going to tell you a little bit about, basically this video is a review, a review of shower gels, all these shower gels are like even a pound, like in a shop called Savers, so fucking go get them. What the fuck are we expecting from this video? What the hell? Fuck! A shower gel review? Are you on acid of some sort? No, no bad man here acid saying. I'm just gonna tell you about what I love and my secret fucking obsession with shower gels. Something that I love, I love every fucking product out there so I'm gonna buy all the best ones I believe and then tell you a review on YouTube about them. I have reviewed many different things and I'm gonna start off with shower gels and then I'm gonna go on to other shit and basically I'm gonna tell you what I think of it, what it's like, what it does for me, and then maybe you good bitches will go buy it, but for a pound, fuck it. Here we are first, this is Carex, this is the strawberry fun one. This is what I rub it up in the tub with. I have to get my bath creams in soon because I'm just getting too many shower gels because I have a shower, but then I have a bath as well, and I want like, a more baths. I, I'm sick of showers now, but shower gels are what make my showers a little bit, you know, more fun. Now, when you get this one, everyone knows when you go into a shop, you start like testing the products, like some of them, like the shower gels, you grab them and you go, you don't want it in your nose, because uh, when it gets in the nose it's fucking it's disgusting when it goes up your nose and in all of your hands and ugh. But this one is so fucking sensual, it makes you feel fucking glamorous. When you put it on your body with a big frother, it foams up and it fucking works with your body. You feel glamour, you whip yourself and you go, yes, yes, in the shower. <sighs> Rubber fucking dubbing in the tub. Get a motherfucking loofah, they are just like a big fucking round thing, you just say hang up on the side and I love them, I didn't know what the fuck they were at first, but ever since I started buying all the products that I want, when I want, when I want, that cheap saying, but when I started buying all the products that I want, I started to love it and I knew I needed a loofah because imagine you think your hand was so trampy and peasantry, but when you use a loofah, it froths the fucker up. It enhances the smell, it comes all sensual all over the bodies and this one is one pound bath and shower. Now another very very royal range of a shower gel is this Imperial Leather. They have these new sensual smells. They are fucking so intense. You feel so like you're in the mango, you're getting into a mango and you're fucking gobbling it. You want to just drink this, you want to fucking get a nice cocktail in your bath or in your shat and just go man. Oh! Fresh! You feel fresh and clean and mango, you feel like you're becoming a mango. This one is very intense, it's just a matter of opinion though, if you want a very fruity fucker one, like, it's like perfume, you have your secret scents, you know, your, your musk, your flower, this one is the fruits, the mango, now I'm a mango fucker, I love this one, I scrub in in the fucking shower, getting it all over the body and working the shit. Now this one is just a 250ml, so I won't be, well, I feel renewed after every shower. I feel fresh, I feel like I'm a new person. I feel like, you know when you're really BO'd and sweating and you look like, you smell like you feel, and when you get this on, it mangles your fucking body down and glamours you up. So one pound, fucking grab it. Oh my. Oh my god, this one is just like fucking sweets. You know like you get the opal fruit sweets or the sabas? 
that is why I love that. I love sweets. I'm out. Probably why I love shower gel so much. And because I've actually kind of quit eating sweets. I don't actually eat sweets as much as I used to eat sweets out of control. But now I've turned to shower gels instead of sweets. I'm so fucked up in it. I used to be a big massive sweet fan. Get so many sweets. And then I cut them out of my life. And I went on to shower gels. So I spent all my money on shower gels. And this is just one pound. 250 ml as well. Great for out of control. It's fresh. It's fucking good. It makes your skin feel fresh and new. Now, what's the next one we got? Oh my god, I'm sorry. I'm right, calm down. Calm down. Oh my god, I'm full blown. Like, I feel like I'm fully blown. You know, like you've had a really, like, hypochondriac sort of thing. I'm gonna be rubbing, rubbing in the tub. Rubbing in the tub, right. I love it! I love it! I love it! Right. I love this motherfucking shower gel. This is the original sources, just one pound. And what's best about this is it's an enhancement of lemon. Like this is out of controllably lemon. You know, like you get like a mint or something. It's like that. And lemon curd. Lemon curd. Like, you know, lemon curd. Lemon curd all cake. It reminds me of cakes. Like, you know, like the top coating of a cake. It's like that but on your body, and I think what's, what I love most about shower gels is like, that I feel like I'm having the sweets and I'm feeling fresher. Now, this is a twist of fate, a twist of acid tripping fate. This is the mint one, the mint and tea tree. Um, this is another one where it's like a, you know, in very enhanced smell. Oh, oh, oh. It went in my mouth. Ah! But, mmm, mm, actually, uh, <laughs> I'm just eating it. <laughs> Should I be eating shower gel? Uh, uh, I'm eating it. Uh, I'm sorry, it's just so nice. I really want a mint now. Mm, um, um, I <laughs> don't think it's good. No, I'm sorry, don't eat the shower gel. I ate it, but... Mmm, I'm just gonna rub it on my lips, sorry. Right. <laughs> I'm, just <laughs> I'm just rubbing shower gel on my lips. I wanna, oh my god. I need to end this fucking video quick. I wanna go in the shower now. Oh my god, that one. It's the most intense, like, mint you could ever get. You know when, you know, shampoos, you can get a minty textured one. This is it, and it, your body, it tingles. Your body is, like, you're vibrant. It's fucking, oh my, my whole lip is like bursting and tingling right now. So this one will really tingle your whole body. It will freshen you up. You will feel like a cool mint fresh all over your body. Like your whole body will be warming and be cool. It'll be hot and cold at the fucking same time because you're in the shower, but it will, mm. <gasps> Now we have here, this is the Radox one. I love Radox. They have loads of good bath foams, but this is a shower gel review, and this is the Berry Burst. It actually comes out white. You would think this would come out like, you know, a vibrant see-through colour that's enhanced with a pink with it, but no, it's just a white consistency. It is very, very, you know... Oh! Oh! oh I don't want that going up my nose. But, um, have you ever been in a shop where you've gone like this, and you've gone... And it's gone up your nose, and your whole nose is tingling out of control, and you're like... You know what I mean? You want to get the product out of your nose. So make sure you keep your eyes secured and safe while you're using these products in the shower. I'm sorry, I'm going on about nothing. There's nothing to do with a shower gel review. I'm meant to be reviewing the product for what it is and what it's for. And what it does to me is just makes me feel new and good. And this is another 250ml. Most of the shower gels actually for a pound are 250ml. I have got some that are more, but I'm getting onto them within the review. Because normally I would buy ones that are more because they last me longer. But then when you see these beautiful bright quite coloured ones that are intense you use too much of it because you want more on you and you keep grabbing it and you keep like you know keep frothing up with the, the volleyball thing you can't stop yourself you want more and more and more on your body because it's fresh right now I'm on to this berry burst one this one actually does come out the colour of the red which I was like oh I'm squirting them everywhere I don't know why it would be red if the other one isn't but you know, it's their preference, it's their choice, they made it, they made it, what they wanted to do, what they wanted with the product, okay, so don't fucking, don't ask me, I'm just the reviewer here, I'm the person that bought these all, and I wanted them, because I want them, and I want what I want, what I want, right, 
I'm kind of saying that cheap saying. I love them! I had such an awkward moment with this one though. This went right into my eyeball. So you've got to keep yourself safe when using shower gel. The loofah, it does like froth it up so fucking much. There's everywhere over the room. My hair is fucking me up. When you love products, you cannot stop buying them. You're here to know which is the best shower gel on earth because I have been there, I have been in the shower, I've been scrubbing my fucking body down because I have found the best shower gel in the whole world. Yeah, so the best shower gel in the whole world is brightly coloured ones, one that have a very enhancement smell, but some of them are shit and cheap. Don't go for some cheap, because they're all a pound anyway, so why would you get some cheap dog muck one when you can get, you know, ones like this Nivy one that's a pound? But just make sure you buy in the correct shop, like Savers or if it's an offer somewhere a pound, because this one is normally around, like, 250 or something like that in other shops, but then savers is a pound. This is one of my like boring sort of shower gels that I just sort of like bought because it's Nivea and I know that it's going to moisturize my skin in the shower, like my whole body. And it's just sort of one I love to just uh, it's a nice flower touch to it, you know, and it's like a cream, creamy paste that comes out. And sometimes I love the fruit ones, but sometimes they don't like make you actually as clean as you could get like sometimes I would use the soap after as well but when I use this one I know that it's a very good cleansing like washing the body better because the fruity ones they just smell nice that's why I love them so I've got like two shower gels in the shower ready for me to use the one that smells nice and then the one that cleans because I don't want to leave them all out my family they take my shower gels they all want my fucking shower gels they're trying to rob my shower gels they're my shower gels I'm not giving a shower gel well they're trying to take my fucking shower gels off from me that my mum's like can I have a shower gel I'm like no you ain't fucking having a shower gel I'll buy 20 shower gels and you ain't having one Pat. Pat, I don't think you're having a shower gel. They're my fucking shower gels. Not yours, bitch. Go buy your own. This is my Nivea shower gel. If I wanted to get this one for me, it's for me. Because I'll give it to her. I'll go, oh, have this shower gel, Pat. She'll take it, right? She'll put it in the shower. It'll be there for one day and gone. Gone out of my life. One pound down the drain, which I wanted to spend on me rubber dubbing in the fucking shower. I know it's a pound, that's how sad is that when I bought nine of these fucking shower gels. Well, there's another 20 downstairs, but today I bought nine. And, you know what I mean, like, why would I want to give them away when they're for me? You know what I mean, they're mine, my shower gels. Not fucking that bitch. Oh, this video's coming to, like, a climax, and we've got two more shower gel stuff to review. Well, sort of me just sort of going on, sort of a bit, isn't it, realistically? I'm not really telling you much, I'm just telling you they're so fucking good for you that you want to go mad and grab more and get more every week. So that's what I do with my wages, I buy shower gels. <laughs> I'm obsessed with shower gels. This was actually, surprisingly, one fucking pound. Now look how different it is to the others. Like, that's the 250ml, and this is a 500ml. For one pound, and this is an Imperial Leather as well. Yeah, the Imperial Liver range. I wish I had this in that size. I'd be in heaven on earth. But this is still good. Like, I thought, I didn't really want to smell it. I just sort of grabbed this one. Because, this one's like, very minty. It reminds me of an aftershave, actually. Ocean Fresh. It's very aftershave. What the fuck were you expecting? me to say oh it's so fucking foamy it made me feel fucking flawless on the body it just you know you don't want a dirty discriminal body you want to look fucking good so climax to the video here's my other shower gel you know this is a circus blast this is another fruity as fuck sort of one. Oh my now that's nice i would use actually these in the bath as well but i want to get bath foams as well because they're more pacific. These I would squirt onto my thing, I can't remember the name of it, but yeah, I would squirt it on while I'm in a bath and rough it up and then I would just rub a dub in that tub. I would rub a fucking dub in that tub. And I will be using, I don't think, um, I don't know, which one should I have in the bath? Should I have this one? Because it's nearly run out. I've been using that like a fucking lunatic. Okay guys, so the climax of the video, my favourite shower gel is the Imperial Leather range because they've got Ugh, get up! Uh, uh. Oh, good. Oh, yeah, this is my favourite shower gel range. It's so good for the body. You know, you've got your, your fruity as fuck ones, and then you've got your cleansing ones, so them on the side of the shower, you'll be fucking floor. Alright, so just um, comment below, like, what's your favourite shower gel? I will next be doing another review on something else, like a product-wise. Just say what you want to see, because you'll get what you want, just 
Come on, fucking tell me for fuck's sake! Sorry, but what did you expect from a shower gel review? Don't come complaining to the bitch that's doing the fucking shower gel review. You got what you fucking wanted. You clicked the fucking picture for a reason. You ain't fucking clicking for me to go, This is so nice, I feel so good in this on. I'm not that kind of bitch. I'm the kind of bitch that tells you it's a fucking shower gel and I fucking got as many as I wanted because I want it. Right. All right, bitch. So I'm sorry. It's fucking loud. I'm, I can't help being so loud. I just want to tell people that you've got to buy all the shower gels because I have an secret obsession with shower gels. I've got so fucking many now and I don't know which one I want in the bath. I'm going to put every single one of them in the whole bath, all of them together. Do you want me to put every fucking one of those shower gels in one bath and then get in it? Woo! Middle parting realness. So, um... <coughs> Let's begin. I've got a really bad cough. I don't know what's going on. Um, so I'm going to put all the shower gels in the bath together because I like a little bit more. Here goes the first one, the Imperial Leather one. This is just the Circus Blast. In that tub, I'm going to rub it up in that tub. I'm going to be rubbing it up in. One second left. 